Well, right, it's time for the paper review now. Yeah. Let's take you across the papers uh, and see the headlines jostling for your attention uh, this morning. And we have joining us uh, the managing editor of Gloom TV, uh, a regular on the show, Adele Adio. Good morning, Adele. Good morning. Thank Good you morning. for having me. Good to see you. Right. Okay, we begin with a punch. APC defectors are weak. Selfish, says <laughs> Buhari. And uh, Atiku in response says, President is Nigeria's most incompetent leader. Very strong words there from both uh, leaders. Oh, yeah, yeah, quite, quite strong words. Yes. Um, I mean, he, he made those statements when he was, um, you know, receiving, uh, receiving his nomination form that was, his, um, uh, you know, yeah. put together mm -hmm. by well-meaning Nigerians. <laughs> <laughs> who were kind-hearted yeah. to buy the president um, the nomination form. I think Nigerians are yeah. very we're generous. Very, very generous. I mean, it's just <laughs> Nigerians <laughs> are the ones buying forms from for politicians Kaduna now. Yeah. But the well, one in Kaduna is very dramatic yeah. when the Market Women as Market Association, Market Traders Association came Dissociated to say that. Dissociated themselves from We didn't buy the forms for <laughs> the governor, <laughs> Rufai, please. <laughs> we Leave us out of this. <laughs> you know, but yeah. you see, the, 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 the moral fortitude would really have been, you know, when the president... Um, made a statement that he could not afford, you mm. know, the 45 million naira, you would have thought that um, he would have led the charge within his party to see that the fees were dropped mm. um, mm -hmm. to, to the barest minimum, mm. you know, and not um, rely on uh, kind-hearted Nigerians well, to put together uh, uh, the funds. As far as he's concerned, the, the weakest uh, of the uh, party members have left, and so oh, we yes. have strong Stronger people, people right now, mm. people who are patriotic, now to face the challenges of uh, governance. Exactly. Okay. Uh, all right. Uh, what else do we have here? Two APC aspirants battled uh, Ambody for Lagos governorship ticket. Okay. Uh, some people are already saying, ah. <laughs> <laughs> I think mean, that's, that's you, you probably know, the when, most when interesting news. small, when they say, gang, gang. Yeah. <laughs> It tells you that it's about the, to go the, down. It's about to go down. The yes, film is tough now. That's yeah. what they say. That's probably the most interesting news, um, you know, coming out. Yes. Um, there's no doubt, you know, that he's he seems to be standing on 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 on, on slippery Very ground. If you if you listen yes. to most of the news, um, mm -hmm. you know, around um, the corner, and, and I don't know what he probably would have done, you know, to have put himself in such a position, you know, as we speak today. Um, let's see how it plays out. Yeah. You know, there are, are, are insinuations that we read in the papers yesterday about, um, uh, you know, a possible, um, you know, seeing how they could take him out of office even before his tenure expires, mm -hmm. which I don't think that would be possible anyway. Uh, but let's see how he plays out. Well, if it's true, well, with the stories we're hearing about his response that uh, with or without APC, he will still win the governorship <laughs> in Lagos State. Well, we'll see how that uh, works. FG gives states conditions for $2.68 billion Paris Club refund. Of course, uh, government is saying pay off all the backlog of salaries and pensions. Otherwise, you will not get this, the latest tranche of uh, Paris uh, refunds. Okay, uh, why IFLS radio station was demolished? Uh, gunmen kill Catholic priests, one other in Imo. Uh, Clark's house raid, an attempt to intimidate Ijo, says Dixon. Buhari's refusal to sign electoral bill ploy to rig uh, 2019 elections. And uh, yeah. PDP presidential aspirants reject consensus, insist on primary. That's from the right. punch. I think those are most of the headlines um, resonating also on the nation newspaper mm -hmm. as we get along now. Uh, APC, Sanwalu Hamza, to battle Ambode for a ticket. Utedola gets PDP ticket offer. Now, th there's also a Twitter um, response which yeah. uh, credited to Utedola saying that he, he's, not no, he's not interested. But however, as we get along, things will play out and we'll get to know. States get terms on $2 billion Paris uh, club refund. Uh, you've talked about that. Farishi asks Assembly to approve 9.9 .9 billion Naira mm. budget. <laughs> budget for Ikiti State until now? Yeah, I mean, it's interesting what, uh, you know, before now I hear that um, Farishi had increased, uh, had employed a lot more people. Mm. Um, and promoted a lot promoted too. Promoted a whole lot of mm. them. Creating problems for the incoming <laughs> governor because if you if is you're that struggling the, is that to the pay, idea? as far as it's concerned, governance continues until he hands over the budget. Yeah, exactly, that's the point. Yeah. So 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 you're struggling to pay salaries now, mm. you know. But then you're so generous, you're so kind to, to the people <laughs> of Ikiti 
that you employ a whole lot more people, mm. uh, promote a whole lot more people, so that when the, when the winner, of course, who won the last elections, yeah. Harry Fami, gets into office, mm. the first thing he has to deal with is an is, unpopular decision. Yes, which you is, know, which uh, is to, to lay off mm. lay off people. Uh, yeah, or, or, and, and, and that puts his and, this, his and these promotions were made just prior okay. to the <laughs> governorship election, as the case may be. All right, let's move on now. Twenty three agreed PDP reps threatened to defect to APC. Okay, uh, NDA year boss drug ring on the V. And the judge angry over a delay in advance trial. Advance is still somewhere. It's still very much somewhere. Mm. And to the Daily Sun, refusal to sign electoral act plot to rig 2019 uh, polls. And that's according to River State Governor. Um, yes, on Wike. Yeah, I mean, I don't see the connection anyway that um, the refusal to sign mm. uh, the electoral act uh, use the plot to rig the elections. In fact, I saw a statement you know, released by. Um, um, Senator Ita Inang, mm -hmm. who is the you know liaison person of the president of the National Assembly, mm -hmm. who argued in a statement that he released that um, the 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 bill that was not given accent yes. did not contain the card reader, the card reader fact, yeah. factor in mm -hmm. it. Uh, mm -hmm. So, and I'm sure that's what the point. That's the point that Wiki is making that you know the card reader factor. Mm. It, it's what you know he's alleging. Mm -hmm. You know the, the, they want to use to rig the elections, but you know Ita Inang has clearly stated. That, that, that it has nothing not to do with the card reader. Okay. Um, and moving on, the board headline, of course, we cannot uh, shy away from this one. 2019, Bola Tinubu dumps Ambode, backs Jide Songwulu. Ambode Hamzat also in fierce battle for APC governorship ticket. Uh, direct primaries to decide candidate. And 57 LG bosses sign up for Songwulu. Okay. <laughs> it's getting quite dramatic it in Lagos now. Oh, yes, oh, yes. Who would have thought, really? <laughs> You know, like they say in politics, uh, 24 hours is a it's long so much. time. Yeah, oh, yeah, this can happen. And, and he, still, can he happen. still has about, um, you know, 14 days to the primaries in Lagos yes. State. So he still has a lot of time to, to amend his ways. Mm. <laughs> you Are know, you sure? And, and, is it not get, too late? Well, well I don't, nothing I don't, is too late, I happen, guess. Like you rightfully said, yeah. you know, 24 hours is a long time in politics. However... Um, you know, from our part, you know, we'd like democratic exercises. Mm. It's good to see three people battle out, battle yeah. out in mm. primaries. Let them have a rigorous debate. Mm -hmm. um, let them have people test their come popularity. Test your popularity. Indeed, with the direct well, primaries. Okay, yeah. and uh, Buhari hits defectors, picks APC nomination form. The campaign's weak, selfish, party list conditions for consensus uh, candidates. So many other stories there. Okay, let's move to the Vaga newspaper mm -hmm. now. Second term, Lagos on edge as Tinubu rallies against uh, Ambode. And has uh, multiple riders here. Mandate uh, group forwards uh, LSDPC boss Sangwalu for uh, governorship. And excuse me, I'm body weighing options as chairman of 57 local government and LCD is desert him. And uh, impeachment on the cards, Tedala on PDP's radar. Well, just mm. so much, so much, so much. <laughs> 2019, selfish, corrupt politicians have left APC. Buhari is saying that and accepts ex expression of interest form. Okay, but these same politicians were not selfish and were not corrupt and were not uh, featherweight when they left when PDP they left for, for APC, APC in 2014. It's all right. Mm. APC governors kick against conditions for consensus uh, candidates. Right. Why is it so difficult to simply conduct a primary election? <laughs> I mean, it, it's, it's as simple as ABC. Happy? Conduct a primary election, <laughs> you win, you lose, mm. everybody goes home happy. Yeah. You know, this idea of a consensus that can never be consensual, <laughs> I don't get it. <laughs> There's no way you can and have... An unconsensual have, you know, consensus. Exactly. <laughs> All right. Debt owed China only 8.5% of external debts. That's the uh, debt management yeah, office yeah, is uh, mm. revealing that. As federal government seeks $6 billion fresh loan for a bad on Kaduna rail project. Okay. More more loans and more loans. Governor also government labor head for showdown over new minimum wage. A federal government gives conditions for fresh two point seven billion dollar Paris Club refund to states. Well the minimum wage issue is going to get a little more controversial as we get to yeah. as yeah, we get to I the mean, end of September. A lot more controversial. Yeah, I mean the truth is um, you know, the labor union are asking for monies that I do not think um, that the government at the various levels um, can really afford. Is um, it because they can't afford it or because they're the not willing is, to? The truth is they can't Though afford it. Though they have it. said they are not there to pay only salaries. Yes, mm -hmm. but the truth is okay. they, they, they cannot um, afford it. And if you, if, you, if you raise that wage up, mm. up to that point, you're going to drive an inflation um, you know, and take us back to what was popularly known as the Udoji Award of 1974. Oh, the 70s. Mm -hmm. um, so um, I, I do think that what the Labour 
union should be fighting against mm. is the kind of monetary policy that we have run over time that has caused okay. an uh, inflation in our economy. All right, all right. Uh, very quickly to the Daily Trust now. Disquiet in Lagos APC as Ambode's aide joins governorship race. FG gives states conditions to, uh, well, the papers are basically re-echoing, you know, the same thing this morning. Buhari slams National Assembly as panel recovers 769 billion Naira stolen funds. Mm. Mm. Okay. And so he's been begging them actually to pass the proceeds of crime uh, bill uh, so that uh, these things can be dealt with as quickly as possible. Well, I mean, I have not seen the details of mm. that bill, you know, but what I do know is that um, the National Assembly has passed, um, you know, about five critical bills that were supposed to aid in the fight against corruption. Remember mm. that they passed the whistle whistleblower uh, policy bill. Yeah. Uh, you know, they've passed several bills that has, that has actually been uh, been aimed at um, fighting corruption, mm -hmm. you know. So um, I've not seen the details of that particular bill. That No, we have from. not, uh, but uh, we'll get to know that. And this, there's it. this long, uh, you know, tailback of traffic uh, along the uh, Abuja Kefi Road, Kefi Road in, in yesterday. Abuja. Ah, It's really serious. You want to feel sorry for the people that found themselves <laughs> in that traffic. <laughs> uh, Swiss law protects corrupt individuals, that's minister saying, and Nigeria to deport 36 Indians and two Koreans. Mm. Okay. It's a long time we heard <laughs> of Nigeria deporting, deporting anyone. anyone. <laughs> <laughs> Remember the Ghana must go? Oh yeah, that was How so many years started? ago. Oh All right, Ayodele Adio, thank you so much for joining us. Thank you for morning. having me. Thank you for having me. Thank you thank so you. much.